What's up folks, I decided to make this quick update about this route I designed for farming on the moon because I discovered a few new things about it. Um, first of all, I missed uh, several boxes that I just wanted to point out, and so I'll do that. I think there are about six boxes here. Uh, these are near uh, this first cave, so if you don't know what near uh, cave number one means and so on and so forth, then watch my other video and I describe these different areas. So this is above spawn room number four, as I named them in the titles in the previous video. And right beside that, there's this little ledge uh, pad that spawns uh, two different boxes right here. So I thought I'd show examples of that. And then finally, right above spawn room six here, uh, there's this one box and I kept looking on the roof here and never saw anything. And so I just dismissed it, but turns out that there is one that spawns there at least. But the main thing I wanted to update about this video is that it actually is kind of useful to do this at level 20 and above because you can actually get good stuff as I show here. And uh, furthermore, one thing that I didn't know that you could get at all until I started finding these is blueprints for ships. And I don't think it matters that that box was open. Uh, but you can see Quite Content Damsel uh, is a ship a blueprint that I just got. So I'm going to pop over to the tower. And you'll see I've got my other icons there. But I've got this one over in the hangar area. And so you can unlock these blueprints. And you just get the ship. It doesn't cost anything. All you have to do is find the blueprint and you get the ship free. So these are the ships that I'm about to show you that I found. I found three of them. Uh, they seem to be coming at about a rate of one per hour of searching. Uh, and of course, you're getting all the other stuff while doing that. But this is that ship that I just uh, found the blueprint for. And then I found these other two blue ships. So these are rare ships. They're more rare than the ones that are being sold in the store uh, that you can buy with Glimmer. So this is the ship that I've been using since I found some of these ships. And uh, so finally I wanted to point out one of the reasons that I think this is also useful at level 20 is that when you uh, sell these helium filaments to the Vanguard thing, you actually get uh, both rep and marks as well as glimmer for trading those in. And it's for that reason and the other reasons that I've described that it's a pretty good uh, strategy for... Uh, getting various things doing this loot that I designed. So um, check out the other video if you haven't seen it. And uh, thanks for watching.